things happen. Do you know what I mean? People make mistakes. No one's, no one's a robot. But not the police and not breaking a man's neck. Just no. You know what I mean? There's nothing about that justifiable. Society might teach you that where you come from is a disadvantaged place. Do you know what I mean? And as much as it might be in, in the reality of the thing, you can't let it be in your head. I grew up in an, a, an estate in South West London. So I was in a place where my nan did her best to give me absolutely everything. And then I moved, then I moved to Harrow and my mum did the same thing. So it was like, but neither of them fully had it. You know what I mean? They were just doing the best for their children. They drilled into me from when I was young, like you need to get used to trying to make money. And I can imagine that's what it looks like for a lot of young, young youths that come from estates. And I think that my block kind of personifies that, like, I've walked into, into this, this place that I grew up that I used to think was the reason I didn't get that or the reason that I wasn't invited to that or the reason that that person decided to clutch their bag a little bit tighter or whatever the case may be. You think that those are all negative things that make you less valuable as a person. But when you're in that space, in wherever you're comfortable, wherever you consider your block to be, when you're in that space, you're the king or queen of that space. You get me? Like, king of this castle, I'm looking at greatness. Like, you, you need to believe that about, about where you live and where you're from and, and, and what you are. Driving force behind the actual, the actual inspiration for me writing a song like that is the case of Julian Cole in 2013, had his neck broken and he was brain damaged by police. Um, and then three of the police lied about it um, later on in their statements and then, were, and then were convicted of gross misconduct and only fired from their jobs. Like, the, the, the family got no compensation, nobody was criminally charged, and I know people who've gone to prison for less. So it was like, if you can just be a young black semi-pro football player, not even in London, and still get your neck broken by police and ruin your life, he's paralyzed for the rest of his life. You get me? He'll never be able to play football again, say, like, in with respect. And that devastates me, you know what I mean? And as I can imagine it devastates his mum every day. I had to go to her and say to her, yo, like, I've written this song and, I, and it mentions what's happened to Julian and how I, and how I feel about it, and and I hope you I hope you can you can give me your blessing. And she said, yeah, that's that's totally fine. Um, I'm still fighting the case now. We, me and the family are still fighting the case now, and it's been seven years. Feds literally broke my bridge's neck and lied on one of their statements, bro. How can you call that justice when Blue Sea Red there's greyness? But then that will happen, and I don't. It doesn't matter to me. It doesn't matter if it's an exception, like. Things happen, do you know what I mean? People make mistakes, no one's, no one's a robot, but not the police and not breaking a man's neck. Just no, you know what I mean? There's nothing about that justifiable. Like you shouldn't be protected by, by your service prior because of something you did now. Because if I went and, if I'd, been a, if I'd been a philanthropist my whole life and then I went and murdered someone, that, that philanthropy doesn't, is not gonna help me, I'm still going to jail. You know what I mean? Like I'm still going to jail and that's still happening. So if you can, if you can never have committed a crime in your life to my knowledge, Julian hadn't um, up until that point and hadn't and obviously hasn't after. If you can never have committed a crime in your life, then spend your money, go to a club. That club gets locked off for whatever reason. And you're an innocent bystander. You could be an innocent 19 year old black semi-pro football player and get your neck broken by police. There's nothing that can't happen to you. I know, God forbid, probably would have made Jesus cross. That's my blood, family tree. No excuse, freedom cost, took the risk. The video was inspired and kind of the imagery was pieced together from a lot of things I'd seen from both UK and US, like music videos and documentaries and all these different kinds of things that I wanted to portray in the video. And obviously pandering to the fact that it is a music video as well. But like there's little Easter eggs in that, in that, in that video that, that pander towards Julian's situation and pander towards the police and little things like that. And I think we wanted to just, me and Antando, Antando Brown, the director, um, who I brought the idea to, um, him, and, him and the production company, Out Since Tuesday, big up everyone from Out Since Tuesday, because they made that vision come to life. With the My Block video and the visuals, I just wanted it to be very unapologetic. You get me? That's why it's like red and everything is like really dark and in the background and greyish, and but still vivid because the block is still important, you get me? But it's not about the block, it's about the individual. So when, when that mic comes down and you have something, you have a platform to speak on coming from that place, then you use that platform and you speak on that platform and you say the things you need to say because they're things that, they're things that matter. So it was, it was easy to do and it was, it was fun. Um, there was a lot of stuff that went, that went wrong like videos do, do you know what I mean? But it's just the fact that everybody was on the same vein. It's like, all right, cool, we're doing this for our cause. So we have to go ham regardless of what the money looks like or what this looks like, we just have to go ham. You get me? And they we produced an, an amazing video. Like, I'm super proud of it. Yeah,